everyone, I'm joining in a tag today. I've been tagged by the Happy Hoarder. I believe the original tag was from Glam Elegant Living. And I was tagged by the Happy Hoarder. So let's answer these questions. The first question is, why did you name your channel or channels what you did? Well, my channel originally had a different name. It was called JJ Doll Rescue. Um, and uh, I thought it was maybe a bit, a bit long, so. And in fact, someone did, did uh, comment that I ought to shorten the name. And so I shortened it to J Dolls UK because I thought, well, that covers it really. My name's Jay, I'm from the UK and I like dolls, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> Question two, what is your channel about? <laughs> dolls. <laughs> it's about dolls, doll collecting, my collection in general, how I look for, find, buy and collect dolls of all shapes and sizes from the teeny tiny ones to the great big ones. So yeah, basically it's about dolls. Is fall your favourite season? Why or why not? Um, I honestly don't think I have a favourite season. I have a favourite weather, which is warm. I like warm weather. I don't like hot weather, don't like rain. Don't, mind, don't like thunderstorms, <laughs> things like that. Um, I, I don't think I have a favourite season. I enjoy watching the colours turn. I enjoy watching the flowers coming up in the spring. I enjoy being able to get outdoors and enjoy the fresh air. Yeah, I don't think I really have a favourite season. What would you like to do during the fall that you don't normally get to do? Well, over the last year, we missed out on everything. We missed out on bonfire night, we missed out on the um, fireworks and we couldn't get together properly at Christmas or anything so I'd like to be able to do all that this year. I don't know really, I don't think there's anything I want to do that I don't normally do or would, would normally do. You know, I like to spend time with family. Question number five, is this your first channel? Yes it is, this is my first YouTube channel and I'm very happy with it. Question number six, do you celebrate Halloween, Thanksgiving and Christmas and how will you be spending it this year? I do celebrate Halloween, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving here in the UK but I do celebrate Halloween and Christmas. Hopefully I'll be spending it with my family this year. I do like to see all of my children on Christmas Day and we usually have a big family dinner on Christmas Eve which we didn't get to do where we all get together and have a Christmas dinner. We didn't get to do that last year, but hopefully we will be able to this year. What would you like people to remember from you this holiday season? I'd like them to remember the fun and the happiness that we've had and I'd like them to remember spending time with me because I really do enjoy spending time with my family, my children and grandchildren. You know, I just love being around children absolutely love my grandchildren to bits and I really do enjoy spending time with them I, and I hope when they get older that they remember how much granny loved being with them I hope and that's what I'm hoping you know that they remember what is your style of decor and colour theme you're using these holidays I tell you what I'm I'm terrible I'm a real I don't I just don't I don't decorate for Christmas I don't uh, I might do a, a little decoration for the dolls, in which case I, I normally do a bit of a decoration for the dolls and I would use traditional colours and things, but we don't put a tree up or anything. We didn't last year because what was the point? Uh, you know, no one could come and visit us. Maybe we will this year as we hopefully, you know, people can come and visit. We would, I normally would just probably put a tree up and a garland on the banister. I have favourite Christmas decorations, which I keep up all year round, to be honest. I've got my little, can you see over there, there's a little fairy hanging in the middle of there. My daughter gave me that and I love it, so I keep that up. And then in my hallway there, on the shelf, in front of the mirror, you can see my uh, little gnomes. I have them up all year. I love them. <laughs> so I, I, I keep them up all year because I like them. What are you most thankful for this year? friends and family always the same thing friends and family my husband my dolls my youtube family i consider that i have a, a blood family and a youtube family uh, yeah i do and i'm really thankful for that 
Are you ready for the holidays or how do you get ready? I start shopping for Christmas maybe April, May time. <laughs> I only start with a few things but I'm normally ready well in advance, you know, with my Christmas shopping. Are you having any series on your channel? Tell us what they are. Well, not series as such, but I'm doing collaborations with, I do a monthly collaboration that's organised by Tammy Powley. Tammy gives us a word each month and we come up with a video based on that word involving our dolls. So this month it was history and I showed a Florence Nightingale doll because she was a historical figure and I unboxed her and told a little bit about her history. I'm doing a collaboration with The Real Prince Club where it's called Hashtag Down to Dolly Business where we're showing dolls in different lines of work. That's running throughout August. I'm doing one with Marna, the Dolls Gone Goth Challenge. The first month we just did a goth doll. So this month we're doing wedding, well, I'm doing a bride. I'm doing a goth bride. Um, so we do a little video once a week and uh, then at the end of the month we'll show our finished, this month it'll be a bride. Also, Marna, Marna, myself, Beth from Beth Ramsden and Tammy from Peace Craft Dolls with Tammy Powley. We do a regular collaboration around once a month that's organised by Marna from Dolls Rescued and we do different things where we show a Blythe. It's usually based on Blythe and we show Blythes in, for different holidays and things like that. We always seem to be working on something in that collaboration. Your biggest tip for new YouTubers. My biggest tip would be try and relax about it and just enjoy the experience. Don't don't worry about trying to build up your channel. Just try and relax and enjoy it and your viewers will realise that you're enjoying it and if they're interested in the same things that you're interested in they'll come along and, and enjoy your channel. For me it's about enjoying my love of dolls and sharing it with other with other people who enjoy dolls and have a love of them. And question number 13 is show us or tell us about a decor item that you bought recently that you really love. Or well, rather than that, I'm going to show you a doll that I bought recently that I really love. She is my Ashanti. She is uh, Ipple House or Ipple House Ashanti. And I just love her so much. Oh, I really do love her. Um, I asked my friend Kim about her over at Kim's Dolls. And I said to her, oh, do you think I should get her? You know, and she said, oh, yes, you definitely should. But be careful. You'll fall in love with her and you'll want more. And Kim, you were right. And Kim has been giving me advice on um, how to restring her and things like that. And I haven't been brave enough to restring her, but I have tightened up her elastics. My husband helped me to tighten up her elastics and I've got her so that she can stand, stand up now. And she can hold her arm now and she can hold it in a pose where she couldn't before. She can, her knees are not all floppy now. She doesn't fall over backwards when she sits down. Yeah, so that's my Ashanti. I absolutely love her. I've just put this wig on her today. I did make a wig, but the wig I made was too big. I need to, um, I made her a green wig and the green actually really suited. You can see how the colour really suits her. But um, the wig cap is too big. It won't stay on her head. I need to make her one in a smaller size, but this one is one that I bought from AliExpress and I love it. I love that colour on her. She would look good in a bin liner, she would honestly. And she looks good with no wig at all. So she is one of my recent buys that I absolutely love. I know she's not a decor item, but she is for me. She's my decor item and I absolutely love her. So I'm going to put the questions for this tag in the description box below but anyone is welcome to join in and do the tag if they want to i hope you enjoyed that thank you for watching bye for now